The cartoon Futurama presents a solution for global warming. Let's take a look at their idea. Ever since 2063, we simply drop a giant ice cube into the ocean every now and then. They take ice from Halley's Comet, which also exists in our universe, and bring it down to Earth. Let's just assume we were actually able to farm ice from comets. How much would we need? To answer this, we have to take a look at the energy imbalance of Earth. Per square meter, Earth absorbs 0.87 watts more power than it emits. This means the total imbalance is 450 terawatts. So how much energy can the ice absorb? We require 334 joules to melt one gram of ice. Then we are still left with cold water, which will heat up. Let's assume it heats up to the average temperature of Earth, which is 14 degrees Celsius. This would absorb another 29 joules, so each gram of ice in total absorbs 363 joules. The required amount of ice is 40 quintillion grams. That's a cube with the edge length of 35 kilometers. Does this mean... Good news, everyone! No. The problem is, Halley's Comet is way too small. It has less than 1% of the ice required to cool the Earth for a single year. Also, there is another problem. Comets contain CO2. Halley's Comet consists out of approximately 3 or 4% CO2. So if you drop a cube with an edge length of 35 kilometers in the ocean, we release 1.4 teratons of CO2. This is 37 times the amount of CO2 humanity releases each year. So even if we were able to get ice from comets, it would be a terrible idea, since it would heat up Earth instead of cooling it down. 